having a different visualization right now that I won't mention, but I'll just wait till the scene's over. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> this week's episode of Two Freckle Friends is brought to you by Black Cats. It is spooky season. Something freaky is about to go on today. Close your eyes, close your eyes, and relax because everything's fine. Uh -huh. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your girl, Allie. We appreciate you tuning in to a special Halloween episode of Two Freckled Friends. If you like your bumps filled with goose, <laughs> please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel by clicking on that beautiful button, as well as tapping on the bell icon to stay up to date with the latest notifications as to when we drop new episodes right here on Two Freckled Friends. This week, I'm not going to lie, I am scared about what we're watching. I had a burned copy of this <coughs> years ago. Haven't seen it since. We are praying to the black cats for love. If you're brand new to our channel, we're going to watch Coraline, give our own thoughts. And from those thoughts, we will provide this movie with its official freckle score. So without further ado, it is the one, the only, Coraline. Let's roll it! Mm, something told me to say black cat. Hello? Hey, that hair bob gotta go. Who's there? Why don't you got freckles? Well, I'll say this, this set design's better than James and the Giant Peach. <laughs> Scared me to death, you mangy thing. Why lip pouting? Not talking, huh? Where's Salem? Bring back Salem. Magic Dows and show me the well. <laughs> Get away from me! Watch it be like her brother or something. Uh, let me guess, you're from Texas or Utah. I heard about water witching before, but it doesn't make sense. Ow. Don't like being stopped. Sometimes they'll come in my window and bring me little dead things. I'm from Pontiac. Michigan. Michigan. Water witch. Where's the secret well? Y you stomp too hard and you'll fall in it. See? Surprise she let you move in. My grandma owns the Pink Palace. Won't rent to people with kids. I'm not supposed to talk about it. I'm YB. Well, you're talking about it. YB Lovett. Coraline Jones. Why did they give this kid scoliosis? I think I heard someone calling you, why born? Why were you born? I give her a crooked nose too. You know that sphincter can't function properly? Great to meet a Michigan water witch. Witch! I'd wear gloves next time. Dowsing rod of yours? Uh, it's poison oak. Ah! Ooh, that bike's kinda cool though, wait a minute. I almost fell down a well yesterday, Mom. I would've died. Mm-hmm. That's nice. I think it's perfect weather for gardening. Mud makes a mess. You and Dad get paid to write about plants. You hate dirt. Kitchen has potential. I don't have time for you right now. Now why they give her the Cindy Crawford mole? Some kid left this on the front porch. Look what I found in Grandma's trunk. Oh, it's his way of flirting. Huh. Oh, lordy. A little me? That's weird. Way too old for dolls. As you take it with you. Hey, Dad. Who has Michigan ties with a Michigan State shirt? Hello, Coraline. Coraline doll. Do you know where the garden tools are? <laughs> <laughs> Don't even think about going out, Coraline Jones! Then you won't need the tools. That is computer neck. <laughs> this house is 150 years old. Go so explore and leave me the fuck it. alone. Let me work. That type of attitude impacts your kids. I ain't fucking asked to be here. Oh! Oh! Are those scorpions? You don't kill scorpions like that. No, no, no. Go! This house clearly didn't pass its home inspection. That's actually what your ass gets for not having a time machine back up. That would be bothering the hell out of me, Coraline. Huh? Hey, Mom! Where does this door go? Really busy. Please! Oh. Will you stop? Pestering me if I do this for you. Pestering my ass? You should have bought me a Nintendo 64, bitch! We're GoldenEye and Donkey Kong Country! Bricks? 
I don't get it. Close this off when they divided up the house. Why is the door so small? We made a deal. Zip it. Oh, I give you bowls of porridge. Ugh. Why don't you ever cook, Mom? You stay out of the way. <laughs> As a millennial who can't afford to pay their student loan debt, I'm sympathizing with Coraline having distracted workaholic Don't parents. Forget. Don't forget about me, guys. Moved away from her friends. Uh... Good night, little me. You know it's bad when she's chasing mice in the middle of the night. I'm having a different visualization right now that I won't mention, but I'll just wait till the scene's over. <laughs> what the fuck? Hmm, <laughs> something smells good. Alternate Mom? universe is this. You're just in time for supper, dear. You're not my mother. But 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 buttons? I'm your other mother, silly. Tell your other father that supper's ready. Is that a roasted chicken? Hello, Coraline. Want to hear my new song? This piano plays me. Making up a song about Coraline. Who's starving? Raise your hand. Mmm, this chicken is good. Hungry, aren't you? Another roll? Sweet peas? Corn on the cob. Ooh, a Sunday roast. <laughs> We've been waiting for you, Coraline. I thought we'd play a game. Called Kill the Child. Hide and seek in the rain. What about the mud? We love mud here. It's great for poison oak. How'd you know I better get home to my other mother? I'm your other mother. Other, other mother. Mom number one. <gasps> What's shaking, baby? This must be like some type of dollhouse or something. Alternate dream reality world. Loper. Where's your swampers and chooks? Can't wait till summer. The mud. <sighs> See you soon. See, it was out of three freckle because she had freckles, but mm. <sighs> My poison oak! It's gone! Huh. Only you weren't really you. You were my other mother. Dreamed you ate all that chicken. Can you get me some of that magic mud? Writer's rash on my... Uh -huh. Why don't you go visit downstairs? Actresses would love to hear your dreams. But you said they're dingbats. Mm-hmm. Wait a minute, that's an apartment? How many apartments are there? Bobinski. Mm, them steps rusty as hell. That structure is definitely not up to code. I think our mail got mixed up. Should I leave it outside or... <gasps> hmm. Is that a cauldron? That wasn't a cauldron, was it? Jumping mouse circus not ready. Brought this for you. <sighs> what the world? This mix-up to sneak my home and peek at mushkas. They sound like the guy from the train and Rugrats movie, which is not a compliment. And I am the amazing Bobinski. But you, call me Mr. B. Das Vidanya, Caroline. Not Das Vidanya. Oh, God. Core a lot. That's gonna be a long one. Debate! No! <laughs> oh, my God! The mice asked me to give you message. Do not go through little door. It's all bricked up. Sometimes the mice are little mixed up. Make sure you keep your crotch away from my head, bro. Coraline instead of Caroline. Maybe I work them too hard. I bet you this child is more tolerable when her friends are around. I feel bad for her, I really do. <laughs> this is the other apartment. Caroline. Still Coraline, Miss Spink. The new neighbor, Miriam. Caroline. Departed angels. We had them stuffed. Hand pulled taffy from Brighton. All people stay with a candy dish. Tell me your future. Oh, you are in terrible danger. Your eyes are going. Tall, handsome beast in your future. Why do I feel like the one on the right could have been Jack A, but it's not? What should I do? Never wear green in your dressing room. Thanks for the tea, though. Danger? Where'd this fog come from? <laughs> ah, look at the beetle. The village stalker. Ow! We're hunting banana slugs. He's a wuss puss. <sighs> that doll. Did you make it look like me? I found it that way. It's older than grandma. I've never been inside the Pink Palace. Grandma, kill me. Dangerous or something. Dangerous? She had a twin sister when they were kids. Grandma's sister disappeared. This is like a Michael Jackson show level fog. She says she was stolen. Maybe she just ran away. Look, I, I gotta go. Wait a minute. Letting this stray cat on top of your hair. <laughs> She's getting 
the colonic every night. Welcome back, darling. Would you go fetch your father? My other father. Your better father, dear. No! Shh, shh, shh. Shine on, shine on, harvest moon. This is definitely some Alice in Wonderland shit. Our garden, Coraline. He riding the damn ant from Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. Tickle no more, you dragon snappers. I can't believe you did this. Mother said you'd like it. Mr. Bobinski has invited you to come see the jumping mice. Great. Another wipey. Hello? I thought you'd like him more if he spoke a little less. I fixed him. Damn. House is cleaned up, fresh coat of paint, power wash, the stairs aren't rusty. This damn sure do look like a Polly Pocket. Whoa! <gasps> Got any kettle corn in there? <laughs> and any house to come. Circus and Batman Forever is better than this shit. And people die in that act. Dasvidaniya, Coraline. Oh my gosh, not the Dasvidaniya. Why is YB in my bedroom? What the fuck is wrong with y'all? See, now this child's gonna be like, real life sucks, I can't wait to go to sleep. Come on now. Ugh. Look at her. I saw a real mouse circus. Charlie, they'll love the new catalog. You dizzy dreamer. I'm not five anymore. The dreams aren't dangerous. Most fun I've had since we've moved here. Miserable. If things go well today, I promise I'll make it up. It's what you always say. Won't be long. I might be. She just got tetanus too. <laughs> How'd she know it was up there? You know that toilet bowl water that's like hella blue, like chemically blue, like blue like her hair? She looked like she'd been drinking that. Okay, y'all, okay. I knew it was real. I need some preparation age. You shouldn't have fucking come during the day. I hope you like the new outfit I made you, mother. I'm not the other anything. Is that Keith David? I'm just a big fat wuss puss. I'm sorry I called you that. She hates cats. I come and go as I please. You probably think this world is a dream come true. You're wrong. Other YB told me so. You can't talk. We cats, however, have far superior senses than humans. Who's gonna fall asleep first? I wanna go to the theater like Arthur in chapter five. Hey, YB. She's practically naked. By the bay. What the fuck is this? I can't look. For the theater, April. Magic. Good night, YB. You could stay here forever. Really? Sure. There's one tiny little thing we need to do. Our little doll. Black is traditional. You're not sewing buttons in my eyes. So sharp you won't feel a thing. Ow! We only want what's best for you. I'm really, really tired. I just need to sleep on things. I'll be happy to tuck you in. Uh, you've, you've done so much already. Soon you'll see things our way. I want to hug your face. <laughs> what the fuck? Going home tonight, robots. <laughs> go to sleep. Go to, go to sleep. sleep. She may be stuck there, right? Mom! Dad! Oh, God. Where's the other mother? I want to go home. Soon as mother's refreshed, her strength is our strength. <laughs> Mustn't talk when mother's not here. We're gonna find the other whitey. He pulled a long <laughs> face. Mother didn't like him. <laughs> what do you think you're doing? I'm getting out of here. I wish I could get out of here too, Coraline. Something's wrong. It's the empty part of this world. She only made what she knew would impress you. Oh look, it's the Matrix. She, she just loves something to eat. Mothers don't eat daughters. How do you taste? <laughs> I might play Monopoly on the iPad, I'm not gonna lie. How can you walk away from something and still come back to it? The Matrix. 
They say even the proudest spirit can be broken. So she's a seamstress by trade. I want you to let me go. Is that any way to talk to your mother? You aren't my mother. Apologize. I'll give you to the count of three. Three! Learn to be a loving daughter. Hush and shush. Bell Dam might be listening. You mean the other mother? Don't remember our names. Spied on our lives, the little doll's eyes. We weren't happy. You lured us away. Gave all that we asked. You still wanted more. Let her sew the buttons. She locked us here. Ate up our lives. She can't keep me in the dark forever. Yes, she can. Beating her is my only chance. If you do win your escape, you could find our eyes. Oh! Find our eyes, mistress, and our souls will be freed. Why me? Why me? Did she do this to you? He ain't asked for this. Is that you? Let's go! Come on! How dare you disobey your mother! <gasps> Time has passed. The white be the talks. Bitch, be grateful. You know that, that old doll I, I gave you? Grandma's real mad. You stole that doll, didn't you? Grandma's missing sister. She can't escape without her eyes. I really need to get that doll. Where are you hiding, you little monster? The doll's your spy. Now she watches you. You're crazy. Mom! Dad! How long has she been gone? Hi. Dad! I'm digging in my garden right now. They probably went looking for your ass. Good night, Mom. Night, Dad. <laughs> Do you know where Mom and Dad are? <gasps> How did this happen? Oh, she's taken them. Only one thing to do. You're walking right into her trap. They are my parents. Challenge her then. She may not play fair, but she won't refuse. She's got a thing for games. Coraline, you came back for us. <sighs> Why would you run away from me? <laughs> Why don't you have your own key? Only one key. Be strong, Coraline. Why don't we play a game? Finding things game. What is it you'd be finding? My real parents. And the eyes of the ghost children. If I lose, I'll stay here with you forever and let you love me. And I'll let you sew buttons into my eyes. Win this game. You let everyone go. Everyone you've trapped here. Deal. Give me a clue. A ghost's eye is lost in plain sight. It's a deal. <gasps> well, you agreed to this show. <laughs> It looked like you needed this one, however. Thank you. Come on, quickly! You're back. We aren't finished yet, are we? You still need to find your old parents. Too bad you won't have this. Even if you win, she'll never let you go. I already know where you've hidden them. They're behind that door. Mom, Dad. 
open it. They'll be there, all right. Wrong, Coraline. They aren't there. You're going to stay here forever. Broke my favorite snow globe. Bitch, if you don't shut the fuck up! Good night, Coraline. I'm really sorry I threw you at her. It was all I could think of. You're in terrible danger, girl. The key, miss. Only one at the Belden will find it. I, I gotta hide this somewhere. Her and her sister before she disappeared. Bring her by the house tomorrow. The tulips look nice. Welcome, Miss Lovat. My child was black this whole time. I'm Coraline Jones. <laughs> Let's give it a freckle scar. Alrighty, it is time to give Coraline its official freckle score. You had a lot of well-known actors doing the voice work and visually I can understand if any of the Oscar nominations were related to the production side of this film. However, Coraline is a fantastic example of how visuals just ain't enough. 90s kids were really privileged with TV shows, animation, movies, you name it next level shit. Coraline, as an overall piece of work, the storyline was hard to get behind. And yes, there are a lot of children out there who grew up in family situations where the parent relationship wasn't the best, workaholics, not loving, not nurturing enough. It's not enough to save this. So my Freckle score for Coraline is going to be 1.5 out of five Freckles. It is utter gutter. I can't believe it's not butter. Trash. Drop your thoughts in the comments if you agree or disagree with our scores. And while you're down there, please make sure you like and subscribe to the channel by clicking on that button, as well as tapping on the bell icon to stay up to date with the latest notifications as to when we drop new episodes right here on Two Freckled Friends. I don't need you to think anymore. I need you to hit stop recording because it's time to go.